Welcome to the Daily Boogie, everybody. I'm, I'm who? Who the hell am I? Who the hell are you? Who the hell are you acting 101? Who the hell are you? Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> oh, yeah, I'm going to do it for the block. Make it hot when I drop. Put some collars on top. What? Yes, sir. I'm going to do it how I feel. I'm going to keep it all trio. That's what it do. What? Oh, yeah. I'll put your drink in the cup with your middle finger up. I don't know who the hell I am. Welcome to the Daily Boogie. I and Boogie the Man. And the Daily Boogie is cracking right now. Woo! So look, holidays is getting closer. You know how I know? Because they got two different brands of eggnog at the grocery store. Yes, they do. So today we're gonna battle the Sunnyside Farms eggnog versus the Southern Comfort Vanilla Spice eggnog. Which one is going to taste good and which one will extract memories of Christmases of yesteryears? Which ones will make me sentimental about that homemade ornament I made for moms that never made it to three Christmases after I made it? Let's begin by papapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapap
high. So here we have the Sunnyside Premium Eggnog. Let's give this a, it smells like eggnog. This is the type of eggnog that we get every year you find in your grocery store, the store brand, the eggnog, you know. It reminds me of when I was a youth. And Santa would come down the chimney. Why do, what happened to my voice? Uh, like my memories are like, uh, uh, I don't know what that voice was. I have schizophrenic memories of my uh, back in the day years of, uh, yeah, I'm schizo. Anyway, this is good. This is the eggnog that I grew up on. This is the eggnog that everybody is familiar with. The store brand Sunnyside Select eggnog. Premium, by the way. That's why it tastes so delicious. It's premium. <laughs> Cut. I, I, I'm filming, but do you hear that in the background? Yeah, there's a guy over here on this side of the street. Yeah, he lives over there. Yeah, but he wants to be over here with the leaf blower on the other side of the street. Different block, different street altogether. Yeah, he lives, he, he lives over there. Yeah, see, I'm pointing. He lives over there. And right now, he's over there. Because he likes to blow every aspect of the street with his leaf blower. And suburbia. Yeah. That's what happens. Okay. Off topic. Cut! You leaf blowing son of... Oh. I was just thanking him for uh, blowing the leaves out front. Thank you. Thank you, kind sir. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Back to the Southern Comfort Vanilla Spice Eggnog. They want you to splash a little bit of Southern Comfort in here. This is what this specific eggnog is for. Now, like I said, it smells like Tom and Jerry mix. He's over there now. I hear him. He went around the corner, around the block. He's over there. He's blowing his leaf blower over there now. There must be leaves bothering him all around the area. Okay, let's back to this. You know what this tastes like? When I was a youngster, I don't know, 13 maybe, I tried to make eggnog on, I tried to make eggnog on the off season because I love eggnog. So I tried to make it and I failed. But you know, I put cloves and cinnamon and nutmeg and I blended eggs and milk and I tried to follow some recipe. I don't know if I found a recipe. There was no Google then. So I think I had just assumed a recipe. And um, this is what it tastes like. It tastes like this. And I remember I blended it up in the blender. And uh, when I, my version, I was like, the egg, the slimy part of the raw egg was still in there. I couldn't, like, I put eggs in the blender. I cracked them open, put them in the blender, and just blended them. Because I thought that's what you did. <laughs> that's embarrassing. Cut! So, this here, Southern Comfort Vanilla Spice Eggnog. It definitely does not taste like eggnog at all. It's a totally different drink. But they only come out with it around this time. They label it eggnog. They put vanilla spice on there. It's, 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 it's not even close. I don't even think they were trying to get close to eggnog. They're more like Tom and Jerry mix. Hmm. So, the clear winner is the Sunnyside Premium Eggnog. Mm. Now that's some nog to write home about and tell your family, I drank some nog out of a glass cup and I was doing a vlog where I versed both of them and then this one won and it was premium. That's something to tell your family about like that, how I just told them. Who wanted to better the bookie to bigger the better the better the flaws but never done be bookie the man you never to see me I'll be quick though. From out of the bay you never to mess around with a week they say you're rap so freaking fast that your boy gonna be on Twinkle. Thank you for coming. I'm Boogie the Man as always. Peace, homies.